Happy Kate, and welcome back to Zoo Quest. So I brought you back right now because it started raining, and I was like, yes, it does rain. Ah, oh, but happy Christmas Eve, you guys. It will be Christmas Eve when you are watching this. I'm not recording this on Christmas Eve, but still, <laughs> happy Christmas Eve. Oh, and we're freezing. Oh my gosh, we have to get out of the rain. Oh, the cold of winter has definitely settled in. Oh, thank goodness for our dock house. Hi, Kiba. Hi. Happy Christmas Eve, girl. Oh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, trying to warm up from that cold. It's not cold enough to snow, but it is definitely cold. Oh, I wanted to show you guys something before I forgot. Um, okay. So over here, I know you can't see my mouse because I have that setting off. Um, okay, you can see it desert temple as i was coming back through the boat through this like river thing i saw a desert temple that we haven't explored yet and i was like oh well i don't want to explore that without them so i put a little marker there so we'll have to go and check that out because it might have all kinds of treasures that we can uh take home with us but yes i marked that on the map that's what that is over there so we'll go back to that maybe later today if not today next week we'll see what happens Ugh, I kind of wish the rain would stop. All right, Kiba, we gotta make a run for it. Come on, I have so much stuff I gotta put away. Ah, rain! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Bane? Kiba. Kiba. It's, it's your mate. It's Bane. D did Bane come to visit? Oh my goodness. Let me get you guys out of the cold. Come on. Come on. I'll have to check that present when it stops raining. Come on, you two. Oh my goodness. It's going to smell like wet dog. Okay. Down into the cellar. Come on, you guys. This way. This way. Maybe they like the rain. <laughs> you can make it. I believe. Oh, I'm so proud. Oh my gosh, look at all that water. They just... <laughs> Bane, you look particularly dark. There you go. Oh my goodness, it looks like we did get mail. I'm glad we put the mailbox out. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I have to put some stuff away. Um, I got a whole bunch of clay and I got a bunch of sugar canes, so I want to get everything that I found away, but if it, it wasn't really anything interesting that you wouldn't already know about, so. Okay, be right back. All right, I'm so glad I got to organize because now our inventory looks a little bit better. I did take out some jerky for the puppers because they've been so good. Oh my gosh, Bane, I can't believe you're here. <gasps> Did somebody write in this? Boo boo. Guess who I found running around chasing a reindeer? Well, you probably already know. <laughs> Make sure to give Kiba and Bane pets for me until I get there with Faye. Oh, it's hubby. Oh, by the way, I hope you have room for a reindeer. You have started on the zoo by now, right? Ah, well, I'm sure you have. <laughs> Love you. Love hubby. P.S. If you haven't already, you might consider making a nice yard for Kiba and Bane. Oh. I didn't really think about that, actually. Because we could give them, like, cute little dog houses with beds that they could be in, and that's where they could, like, recover health and stuff. So it was hubby that sent you to me. Well, Bane, welcome. This is going to be a lot nicer than Yellowstone. As far as like shelter is concerned, although I'm sure Yellowstone is far more exciting and beautiful. <laughs> so, oh, he sent puppy treats. We can give our babies puppy treats and the reindeer. Well, we have a barn. We could put the reindeer in a barn. Oh, this good, this good girl. Oh, level up. Good job, you guys! You both got two levels! Um, 
Aw, so Kiba is reunited with a Bane. That is so cool. Thank you, hubby. Aw. All right, we're gonna have to keep these uh, little notes from hubby. I have a feeling that the gift upstairs is also from hubby. But first, I wanted to show you guys, I did happen to get a queen bee while I was out. And that brought me to the idea of, we really need like um, some apiaries for, for honey, because we don't have any honey. And honey is a cooking ingredient that we could use to make all kinds of things. Not only is it a replacement for sugar, if we ever run out of sugar cane, but it makes yummy stuff. Okay, so let's see, hello Zazu. What on earth? Should we check the mailbox first? Oh my gosh, look at all this mail! Oh my goodness! Okay, let's start with the first one. All right, who is this from? A writing book? Dear daughter, Oh, it's for mom and dad. We are so very proud of what you are doing. I do hope you know you have our full support if you need anything. Merry Christmas, Angel. I hope you enjoy your gift. We know you needed one, mom and dad. P.S. We should be coming to visit soon. You do have space, right? No. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I don't. We might need to build a guest house. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, but a writing book. We did need this because I wanted to try and catalog all of the animals that we have collected throughout our adventures in Zoo Quest. And I kept meaning to make one and I completely forgot. But it looks like mom and dad sent that for us. And we already have so many animals that we're going to have to catalog. Oh, no. Okay, so there was that envelope. Yep, that's empty now. So we'll just move that away. All right, let's do this one. Cinnamon? <sighs> Who is this from? Dear sister. Oh, it's from Boo. I miss you so much. I'm hoping to visit very soon with mom and dad. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> we need a guest house. The, p the boat house isn't big enough. Uh-oh. Here's a little extra something to help with your cooking. You always need a dash of cinnamon on your hot chocolate. Merry Christmas, Boo. Aw, that's awesome. Thank you, Boo. Oh, I can use this to make a cinnamon tree, you guys, and we could have a bunch of cinnamon. Okay. All right, last one. Oh, we got a Santa hat. Can I put that on? Hold on. <gasps> it's just like me, except mine is furry. It's got fur on it. <laughs> Oh, we have to wear that today. We're so wearing that today. Okay. And then this. Dear wifey. Oh, it's for hubby. I sincerely hope you got the package I sent. I bet that's what that is. <laughs> I miss you. Hope to be there soon. Merry Christmas, love. Love, hubby. P.S. Plant the tree so I can find you. Plant the tree. I'll be gifted the sacred oak sapling, you guys. We can now have our sacred oak sapling. Oh, I'm so happy. Yes. Oh my gosh, look at all this stuff. There's a decorative mistletoe. We'll have to put that up so when he visits, we have lots of kisses. A holiday cake. I'm not gonna have room in my inventory for all this stuff. Hot chocolate? Eggnog? Oh, I love eggnog. Spiked eggnog is the best though. <laughs> Cocoa beans, you guys, we can make chocolate stuff. Candy canes? Peppermint seeds, we can grow peppermint. Ginger root, that's another type of ginger. Gingerbread men? Look at these cookies. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to open my backpack. Uh, let's just stick these envelopes in there. And then all of these, oh my goodness. I was spoiled for Christmas. 
Oh my gosh. Chocolate covered cherries. Those are like my favorite. A present for Kiba and Bane. And a note block. <gasps> to play. You guys. We can play Christmas stuff. Oh my gosh. Okay, we gotta go put this down. Like right now. Okay, Ross. It's always crab time, right? Right? You always tell me that it's crab time. So. It's really crab time. That's a note block. That's, that's not what I thought that was. <laughs> Uh-oh. Did hubby send the wrong thing? Well, can we make the other one? Hmm. Give me a moment to look that up. Uh -huh. So I realized that um, I just put it upside down. So if it's upside down, I guess it's a, it's a note block. Or if I kept hitting it, it was going to make noise. But I flipped it right side up. And now it is a jukebox. Silly, silly me. <laughs> oh, so what should we start with? Well, let's do this one. I hope this isn't copyrighted. If it is, this is going to get cut. But I'm going to do a jig to some Christmas music. Russ, come on, dance, buddy. Is this not dancing music for you? You want me to try another one? Come on. Come on. Ah, he's not feeling it. Okay, let's try another one. Um, Jingle Bells is pretty cool. It's perfect. Oh, I love it. Can I just leave that playing in here forever? What do you think, Ross? Come on, buddy. It's crab time, right? <laughs> this is not his jam. <laughs> it's my jam, though. Oh, and we're going to eat a cookie right now. I'm, I'm so happy about this. You guys, this is the best. Oh, I'm so spoiled. Oh, it's sleep time, though. It is definitely sleep time. We don't want it to be dark for too long, so let's put something to fit the mood of sleep time. There we go. Ah, oh, what? This is the best. This is the best, you guys. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful Christmas Eve, and I hope you have a fabulous Christmas. We will actually be posting a video for Christmas, um, but I hope that you spend time with your family before you watch it. But yes, aw, aw, even Ross was like, I need to go north towards my hidey hole to go to sleep. All right, it's not sleep time anymore. Let's try deck the halls. Perfect. La 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 la. <laughs> ah. Wow, it plays all the way out here. It's like it follows me. <laughs> well, so what should we do today, you guys? Should we name all of the animals? We haven't named them yet. Oh, our reindeer. <gasps> we need to go release our reindeer. Let's do that right now. Happy Christmas Eve, Emerald Muncher. I'm going to change your name. I hope you don't mind. Imagine walking up to somebody in real life, guys, and saying, I don't like your name. I'm going to change it. Okay, let's see. Boop. Oh my gosh. You have an aura of snow at all times. That's kind of awesome. I can ride you, right? <gasps> this is the best thing ever! What? Wow! Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm on a reindeer. I am legit on a reindeer right now. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, uh, we have to name the reindeer Blitzen. And uh, the reason for that is because when I was a kiddo, like a wee wee one in elementary school, 
there was a tryout to be Blitzen for Blitzen's Boogie. And I won. I got to do the Blitzen dance for Blitzen's Boogie. So you get to be Blitzen! Yes! Ah, this is so cool! You can jump too? Oh, you can jump pretty high! Oh, I am in love with Blitzen right now, who can apparently run on fence rails. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do this for 20 minutes and I'll be back. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, Blitzen, you just walk around until I can get you a name tag, bud. Oh, and we can release our pigs! You guys, this is like the best. So I'm actually gonna need piggy names. Oh, and I almost forgot. We've got a paddlefish we have to release. I feel like it's just Christmas with all the animals we've caught. Okay. All right, here we go. Hi, Mom! Hello! Hi, Mama! Don't worry, I got I got your piglet right here. Boop. Hello! Do you like your new pig? It's nice and spacious, and you got mud that you can lay in. You like it? Yeah? I'm gonna go get you some potatoes or something. Does that sound good? Or I have an empty bucket. Would you like me to feed you some slop? Huh. Oh, wow. They got right into it. Look at that. I'm glad you guys like it. I don't use fence gates for some reason. <gasps> Yay! It loves me! How about you? You want it, piggy? Yay! <laughs> oh, they look so happy. Yep. That's some pig happiness right there. <laughs> well, let's now go ahead and put our wild horses into the stall. We're going to have to get them some troughs pretty soon, though, which might mean mining today. Oh, no. I don't know if I want to go mining. I want to do names. So we're going to have to let them walk around so they can get food and water pretty easily. All right, here's one. Oh, it's the wee one! Hello! Welcome to the barn. Aw, I'm glad you like it. I think it likes me, you guys. Oh, this is a good horsey. Yep, you need a name too. Oh my goodness, I need so many names, you guys. I don't even have names for the cows. I might actually go ahead and name the cows, because they've been around for a while. <laughs> Alright, and then we've got one more. We have our paddlefish. Who we are going to put... Oh, look, the cows and the horses are making friends. <laughs> Our music stopped. That's uncalled for. We must have more. Awesome! Did you... Were you dancing? <gasps> he likes it! Yay! <laughs> oh, my Christmas crib. If these are copyrighted, this whole video is going to be claimed, but that's okay, because we're having Christmas fun. Ooh, I wonder if I can take this now. Huh? Yay, I can re-gift. Okay, let's go release our paddlefish. I'm really excited. I've never seen a paddlefish until the last episode, so I'm super, super excited about that. Oh no, we're too far away. <laughs> we can't hear it anymore. Oh, well. Hello! Hi, Oozle! Happy Christmas Eve! Mwah! Oh, hello, you guys! Hello! You have definitely become full-grown. You're Thomas. And then you two still need names. We'll work on that. Alright, Paddlefish. Eh. No? Uh, just don't die, please. Eh. <gasps> there we go! We released the Paddlefish! That is such a cool looking fish. I really adore it. Please don't suffocate on anything. Please. 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 Okay. Okay, good. <laughs> That's good. No suffocation. Oh, it likes me. Okay. Wow, we have so many animals on Boo Island right now, you guys. It's, uh, it's getting a little crowded. I think that the uh, need for the zoo is becoming more and more imminent as we continue <laughs> to add animals to Boo Island. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and make some name tags 
and we're gonna name some of our babies. I'll be right back in a second. Um, num, 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 num. Um, num, num, num. Uh, I'm sorry, I had to take a cookie break. These cookies are delicious. Mm. Uh, is there any more? Oh, I still have gingerbread men, thank goodness. All right, name tags have been made. All right, puppies, come on. You're gonna come with to the naming process. First stop, Altaria. Good, I got the right one. All right, hi, Timothy. All right, Cloud Phoenix, you are officially Altaria. <laughs> awesome. And Timothy, I'm gonna leave you with her so you're not by yourself until I can get you another turtle. And I already have a name for that turtle and I'm very excited about it. <laughs> All right. Come on, babies. Come on. All right. On to the barn where we will name the cows. I didn't get any name suggestions, so I just went ahead and named them. But there will be animals that don't have names yet. All right, Blitzen. There you go, you has a name. <laughs> All right, where's my female cow? There she is. Her name is going to be Bessie. It just seems like the best cow name, Bessie. <laughs> All right, you are going to be Bull Brigard. <laughs> Bull Brig Bull Briga <laughs> Do you get it? All right. And you are going to be Brutus. Somebody actually suggested that name for the male goat, but I loved it so much I kept it for our our brutal looking cow. <laughs> and then this one will be Bishop. I liked the name Bishop. So that is what we are going to name it. Do you guys want to play? Do you guys want to play? Do you want to play? Whoa. Go get it. I must not have you set to play. I think I have to have you set to, to uh, not aggressive. <laughs> All right, which while they're on the island, I probably shouldn't have them set to aggressive. That's extremely dangerous. Hello. Did you, did you grow up? <gasps> we, it did grow up into a hog. Although I don't approve of breeding between mama and Bibi. So we will not be breeding them. Come on, babies. Sit. Sit. All right. Um. Oh, no. We've we've already named you guys. Never mind. False alarm. False alarm. <laughs> We're going over here to name the other Celo cans. Okay. Are you guys ready? So somebody in an old video, and you know who you are. <laughs> Thank you for commenting. Suggested the name Spot for Thomas, but we had already named Thomas by that point. So we're going to name another one Spot. Probably you. There we go. So there's Spot. Oh, and here's the other one, which we are going to name. Oh. Freckles. There we go. So now we have Thomas, Spot, and Freckles, our CeeLo camps. Very cool. Okay, so real quick before we do our final thing today, which is going to be really exciting. <laughs> I think we need names. We need names for the American Paddlefish. So this is this is all you guys. American Paddlefish. I need uh, names for both wild horses that we've caught. And I need names for our female pig, our sow, and our male pig, our hog. So... Those are five names. The American Paddlefish, the two wild horses, and our female pig and our male pig. So, yes. I need names. Give me names. All right. And then before we run out of time today, we are going to do something really, really special. But I have to go back and grab a thing real quick and probably sleep. So I'll meet you on top of this hill. All right. I'm up here with my puppies. There they are for this very special moment. I sincerely hope that um, this doesn't break the entire game, but we are about to plant our sacred oak sapling. Okay. 
Where do we want it? I think I kind of want it. I actually kind of want it like right over here. Yggdrasil, yay! I didn't know that's what its name was. <laughs> that makes me really happy. Okay. <gasps> there it is! Oh my gosh! There's, there's our sacred oak. Oh my goodness, you guys! Okay, puppies, puppies, come on! We gotta go see from a distance. Let's go! Hop, hop, hop! Oh my goodness! It's huge! Look at it! That is perfect! That is everything I wanted on top of that hill right there! And because we have it, we can have more if we want to. But for now, I am super pleased with that. We're gonna have to light it up though because it casts such a dark shadow that we're definitely gonna have some baddies spawn. But that that is the tree right there, you guys. Thank you, hubby. Thank you for my tree. Okay, you guys. Well, that is all the time I have for this episode. It has been a bunch of fun. We got a bunch of names done. We got to open a bunch of presents before Christmas. <laughs> and that was simply because... Uh, I guess stuff breaks if there's too much shadow beneath it. Anyways, but that's because ZooQuest did not fall on Christmas Day. Um, so we went ahead and did this this way. There's our big tree! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Maybe that'll be the thumbnail. <laughs> Just me under a ginormous tree. All right, you guys. Well, I hope that you had a wonderful Christmas Eve and I hope you have a wonderful Christmas. Merry Christmas. If you don't celebrate Christmas, I just hope you enjoy your holidays, whatever it is that you celebrate. I hope it's wonderful, surrounded by people that love you and that you love and that you feel it, that you feel that love. <laughs> All right, well, make sure you give the like button a tickle and a poke. Subscribe if you haven't already to join our family here. We are small, but we are growing and I love to see it. And I'm amazed at how fast we're growing and that's because of you guys, so thank you. And ring that bell if you want notifications. It's the Christmas time, so ring the bell. <laughs> I love you guys. Merry Christmas and thanks for watching. Bye-bye.